Hi everyone, this is Heather from the Flourish Academy, where our goal is to empower, educate, and elevate you to create a life that you love through the art and business of photography. In this video, we are going to take a trip to the Lightroom Hair Salon, but first, make sure you check out all of the free resources available on our site. I previously recorded a video where we corrected roots on hair. However, in that case, the roots were actually lighter than the hair, and quite frankly, it was a little bit easier. My friend Janelle sent me this photo to correct where the roots are darker. We're going to accomplish this using the adjustment brush. I'm going to press K on my keyboard in order to access the adjustment brush. Now, I'm not exactly sure what's gonna be the best approach for this, but you have to start somewhere. So I know that I need to lighten those roots, so I'm maybe gonna pull up on the exposure a little bit. And when I do that, I know I'm gonna to need to add contrast as well. I might wanna pull down on some highlights, up on the shadows, down on the whites, up on the blacks. <laughs> I mean, to be honest, I'm not sure what this is gonna look like. Now in this case, I'm going to make sure that auto mask is turned off and I'm gonna set my flow pretty low so that I can build up this adjustment. However, I do like to keep the density at 100. Now I believe the key to this adjustment is going to be about adding color back in. So I'm going to click inside of this color box and hold my mouse and drag to this area of the photograph in order to select a color I would like to use. And I think that one will work pretty well. Let's make this brush a little bit smaller with the left bracket key. And we're just going to begin by brushing over the roots in order to lighten them. Let's zoom in with a command or control plus on the keyboard. Make my brush a little bit bigger. And what I'm going to do is just keep brushing to build up this adjustment. The reason I'm doing it that way is because I think it will look a little bit more natural. So I've kept the flow fairly low. If I had that flow too high, the adjustment would be placed on the roots a little bit too strong and I don't think it would work well. So I'm just gonna take my time and brush over the darker areas and build it up as necessary. Of course, we are going to run into issues where the roots meet the hair color right in this area but I'm not gonna concern myself with that. If I really wanted to correct this to perfection, I would take it into Photoshop and use one of the healing tools, but I really don't wanna do that. I just wanna make it look a little bit better. Now that we've done that, I'm just gonna zoom out and take a look at the overall before and after, and I think that looks much better. If you noticed that the brush strokes have bled into the background, simply hold down Alt or Option on the keyboard in order to subtract out some of that adjustment around the edge. Again, I was not going for perfection in this photo. I just wanted to make it look a little bit better. I hope that you found this useful. I'll see you in the next video.